guys, Mr. P, get comfortable. I want you to participate with me on this song as if I were right in your living room with you, or in your office, wherever you are, in your playroom, in your, in your bedroom. Um, just pretend I'm there with you and do what the song says, all right? This song's called Yes, Oh, Yes. You ready? Here we go. Well, we can clap our hands, clap our hands, clap our hands. We can clap our hands, yes, oh, yes. Clap your hands with me, clap your hands with me, clap your hands with me, yes, oh, yes. We can stamp our feet, come on, stamp our feet, stamp our feet. We can stamp our feet, yes, oh, yes. Stamp your feet with me, stamp your feet with me, stamp your feet with me, yes, oh, yes. Where's your toes? We can tap our toes, tap our toes, tap our toes. Do it. We can tap our toes. Yes, oh yes. Tap your toes with me. Tap your toes with me. Tap your toes with me. Yes, oh yes. Now we can blink our eyes, blink our eyes, blink our eyes. We can blink our eyes. Yes, oh yes. Blink your eyes with me, blink your eyes with me, blink your eyes with me, yes, oh yes. Now we can beep our nose, beep our nose, beep our nose, beep, we can beep our nose, yes, oh yes. Beep your nose with me, beep your nose with me, beep your nose with me, yes, oh yes. Auga! We can pull our ears, pull our ears, pull our ears. Ow! We can pull our ears. Yes, oh yes. Pull your ears with me. Pull your ears with me. Pull your ears with me. Yes, oh yes. Now we can jump up high, jump up high, jump up high. We can jump up high, yes, oh yes. Jump up high with me, jump up to the sky with me. Jump up high with me, yes, oh yes. And we can dance around, dance around, dance around. We can dance around, yes, oh yes. Dance around with me, dance around with me. Dance around with me, yes, oh yes. We can spin around and around, spin around and around, spin around and around. We can spin around and around, yes, oh yes. Spin around with me, spin around with me, spin around with me, yes, oh yes. Sit right down, sit right down, sit right down. We can pat our legs, yes, oh yes. Pat your legs with me, pat your legs with me, pat your legs with me, yes, oh yes. We can make our wheels go round, wheels go round, wheels go round. We can make our wheels go round, yes, oh yes. Wheels go round and round. Wheels go round and round. Wheels go around and round. Yes, oh yes. Take a deep breath. We can sing this song, sing this song, sing this song. We can sing this song. Yes, oh yes. Sing this song with me. Sing this song with me. Sing this song with me. Yes, oh yes. Clap our hands, clap our hands, clap our hands. We can clap our hands, yes, oh yes. Clap your hands with me, clap your hands with me, clap your hands with me, yes, oh yes. Mmm, nice job, my friends. We are done with that song. We're going to talk a little bit about loud and soft in music. Sometimes when things get louder, they call it 
crescendo getting louder. And when it's getting softer, it's called decrescendo. Decrescendo is getting a lot softer and a lot softer and very soft. Crescendo gets louder and louder and louder. Decrescendo gets softer and softer and softer and softer and softer. And sometimes we do that in music. There's this song I really like. It's a grown-up song. I don't know the whole thing. But it's, it goes like this. It's, a, it's about being a stranger. And it goes, well, it's so strange. Yes, it's so strange. And they do this really loud boom. And it's the whole band doing it. That's kind of cool. Um, I wanted to try something. Uh, it's called The Rainstorm. And you can help me. And I'm posting um, a link for another video on this assignment, on this activity. So you can check that out. It's, a, it's a, like a big group of people doing the rainstorm. And it sounds really cool when a lot of people do it. When one person does it, just me, it's not going to sound so great. But when you see that other video, you'll see how cool it is. And you can maybe even do this with your family or with your friends and see how it works. So you start out with uh, the wind and you rub your hands for the wind. And then you get it louder. And then the rain starts, so maybe uh, snap your fingers a little bit, right? There's the rain coming. And then try to get a little bit louder and a little bit faster. And then the rain's gonna get even louder, so let's be patting our legs for that. And more rain is coming, so it gets louder. And once in a while, there's some thunder. You can either clap your hands for the lightning, or you can stamp your feet for the lightning. Whoa! Oh, there's the thunder. And all that heavy rain. And it's really loud. And now the thunder stops. And the rain is slowing down. It's getting a little bit softer. And the rain... It's gone and it's just the wind. And then the wind is getting softer. Stop. The wind is stopping. And there. And the rainstorm is over. So that's like dynamics. It's getting louder and softer, just like a heavy, crazy rainstorm with thunder and everything. It gets louder and then softer. And music is like that too. I wanted to do a music song for you that's soft and loud. And it's about Froggies hibernating, and other animals too. I'm going to play the sleeping part for the animals quietly on the guitar, and you can pretend you're sleeping. And then when the guitar gets loud, that's going to be the animals waking up in the springtime. Okay, so lay down and pretend you're sleeping. And I'll play the quiet part of the song. Where are the froggies when the north winds blow? We cannot see them in the ice and snow. Deep, deep down in the mud they lie. Froggies are sleeping with tight, closed eyes. Good job. And when you hear the music, you're going to wake up and start jumping like a happy frog in the springtime. When the warm spring sun comes out, frogs wake up and jump on out. Oh, how happy they will be, a springtime world they will see. Back to sleep! Getting softer. Shh. Now you're going to be turtles sleeping in the mud at the bottom of the pond. Where are the turtles when the north winds blow? We cannot see them in the ice and snow. Deep, deep down in the mud they lie. Turtles are sleeping with tight, closed eyes. Shh. Good job. When you hear the music, turtles wake up and crawl around. When the warm spring sun comes out, turtles wake and crawl about. Oh, happy they will be a springtime world they will see. Oh, yeah. Woo, yes. Mmm, back to sleep again. This time you're
around, you're going to be bears in your caves. Go to sleep, bears. Shh. Lay down. Close your eyes. Where are the bears when the north winds blow? We cannot see them in the ice and snow. Snug and warm in their caves they lie. Baby bears are sleeping with tight closed eyes. Shh. When you hear the music, bears are going to wake up and play. When the warm spring sun comes out, baby bears wake and play about. Oh, happy they will be a springtime world. Chipmunks, lay down, Chippy. Sleeping in their little burrow, their little hole in the ground. Where are the chipmunks when the north winds blow? We cannot see them in the ice and snow. Snug and warm in their burrows they lie. Chipmunks are sleeping with tight, closed eyes. Get ready to wake up and jump around. When the warm spring sun comes out, chipmunks wake and jump about. Oh, happy they will be a springtime world they will see. Oh, yeah. Last time. Here we go. Lay down. Where are the caterpillars when the north winds blow? We cannot see them in the ice and snow. Snug and warm in their chrysalis they lie. Caterpillars are changing into butterflies. Good job. Get ready, big wings, spread out your arms to fly. When the warm spring sun comes out, butterflies wake and fly about. Oh, happy they will be a springtime world they will see. When the warm spring sun comes out, everyone wakes and plays about. Oh, happy they will be a springtime world they will see. Beautiful job, my friends. Okay. You can take a break and, and stop the video for a second if you want to, or we can keep going. We're going to do a little thing called ham bone, and I want to show you the rhythm for ham bone. I think you might have seen some of these notes before. These are eighth notes, fast notes, running notes, and there's a walking note at the very end, a quarter note. And I think that when the way you do it in school usually with Mr. Gay is... You go ta ti a uh, ta ti ta ti ta ti ta ta ti ta ti ta ti ta and that's one way that's a great way to do it the way I do it is I do the counting this is the first beat second beat third beat and fourth beat and in between there's little ands little and signs like a plus so it's one and two and three and Four and that and there's no note there, so I don't play anything there. So one and two and three and four and and it sounds like this: one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. One, and two, and three, and four, and like that. And we're going to do a thing called ham bone. And it's very challenging, so you might need to practice this. I'm going to move my camera down a little bit. Whoa, hey. So you can see what I'm doing on my lap. I hit my leg on the outside. That's one. And I slide over and hit my chest. Two. Well, that's uh, the and, rather. 
one and two, and I take the inside of my hand and go out like that. So it's like this, and then this, and then back out. And then I do it again. This, this, and this, yeah, and then the last one is here on my leg. And I stop for a moment. That's beat four. So it could be one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. Or ta ti ta ti ta ti ta ta ti ta ti ta ti ta okay so let's practice that a few more times are you ready one and two and three and four again one and two and three and four again one and two and three and four again one and two and three and four if that was too fast i'm going to go with, i'm going to try the other hand and i'm going to go slower for you let's try ready one and two and three and four again one and two and three and four again one and two and three and four again one and two and three and four nice so practice that um, and see if you can get comfortable so you don't even have to count it or think it it would be like this one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four one and if that's really hard, another way that you can count it, besides doing the one and two and, or doing the ta ti ta ti ta ti ta, is you could just count to seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. If you want to show me that you can do that when you post your um, response to the assignment, you can do that, um, but you don't have to. But if you can do, that's called ham bone. If you can do ham bone, you say, Mr. P, here's ham bone, I can do it. When you get comfortable, and if you can do it a little bit more quickly, it has a really nice beat to it that goes with music. And we'll, we'll get to that next, on your next assignment in a couple of weeks, all right? So I'm gonna do it with both hands just for fun. And don't forget, Mr. P's been doing that a long time. And that's why it looks like it's kind of easy when I do it. But it was not. I had to do it many, many days in a row and get better and get better and get better. That's called practice. Just like when you learn an instrument, practicing is how you get better and more comfortable. Just like learning how to ride a bike. You don't just jump on a bike the first time and ride away. <laughs> you got to learn to ride that bike and get comfortable with it. So... That's, that's almost everything. I'm just double checking. Yeah, the last thing we're gonna do, this is your actual assignment, is to learn this and do it for me. It's called Grandma's Glasses. And I'm gonna take off my glasses, even though I can't see very well without them, because I'm gonna use pretend glasses like this in my fingers. And you get yours too, all right? Just copy what Mr. P does. Are you ready? These are Grandma's Glasses. This is grandma's hat. And this is how she folds her hands and puts them in her lap. 
These are grandpa's glasses. This is grandpa's hat. And this is how he folds his arms just like that. And that's the whole thing. Let me do it again for you. Ready? Put on your glasses. These are grandma's glasses. And this is grandma's hat. And this is how she folds her hands and puts them in her lap. These are grandpa's glasses. And this is grandpa's hat. And this is how he folds his arms just like that. All right? So you can back this up and try it again and, and learn it. See if you can do it without Mr. P's video. So I'll do it one more time, then I'm going to do the silly way that I like to do, okay? Put on your glasses. These are grandma's glasses, and this is grandma's hat. And this is how she folds her hands and puts them in her lap. These are grandpa's glasses, and this is grandpa's hat. And this is how he folds his arms just like that. Okay, the silly way I like to do it is my grandma came from Russia. And when I was little and she would come over, um, she, she had a very different way of talking because her, her first language was not English. And then for grandpa, there's this really nice man that I met in Maine. Have you ever been to Maine? Well, anyway, his name was uh, Gartley. And Gartley had a funny way of talking too. And I love to just pretend and use their, the way they spoke to me um, for this song. So you can do a silly way too. If you want to, when you post your answer for this assignment, you can do a regular voice or you can do a silly voice if you want to. Any silly voice you want. These are, this is my silly voices. These are grandma's glasses. And this is grandma's hat. And this is how she folds her hands and puts them in her lap. These are Grandpa's glasses. And this is Grandpa's hat. And this is how he folds his arms just like that. All right. Let me get my glasses on. Oh, I can see again. Awesome. Well, guys, have a great day. Have a great evening. Have a great week. Um, make sure you watch all the videos. You can watch them again if you need to. And the assignment for, for you to do for me is to do grandma's glasses. And if you want, you can also include doing ham bone. If you can do that one and two and three and four. If you can do that, that'd be awesome. And that's it. All right. Have a great day. I'm going to end the video right now. Bye.